Hey guys, it's Dirt 77 back with the most godlike menu music. Holy shit, God. Okay, gotta play, gotta play. Can't just sit here and listen to it the whole day. It's just, oh, it's so good. Oh, all right, cool. Let's get back into it. Left off with Knuckles again. Let's see if his pop culture references have improved at all. Following the signal from the Master Emerald, I found myself deep inside this canyon. And you drowned in there too, if you if you forgot Knuckles. Most of it's underwater now. It's gonna be tough finding the pieces of the Master Emerald here. No time to complain about it. It kind of sounds like you're complaining about it right now, though. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's do it. So we know the drill with Knuckles. Three emerald shards, please. Aquatic mine. Yeah, and creepy ass ghosts underwater, apparently, which I'm not super looking forward to. <laughs> All right, cool. Yeah, I feel like I definitely remember this level very well too. Um, I don't know, that intro for some reason, like really triggers something. Like I, I remember, I must have saw that a lot as a kid. For some reason, I might have played this level a lot. Um, Oh, we got a whole water level situation here. Fantastic. Everybody, isn't everybody's general, in the general consensus is everyone's favorite type of level are water levels, right? Like, that's, that's usually how it goes. It's usually water levels and desert levels. I know those are just everyone's favorite. All right, cool. So there we go. That's one. Not in the water. Ooh, perfect. wonder what that's about. All right. So we got another one here. Might be underwater with a creepy ass ghost. Let's see, where are you? Nope. Up, up, up. Man, Knuckles' music is so jamming. So good. I don't think they have the chuckle song in, in this one. That's in, in one. Uh, but yeah, as mentioned before in the previous video and just all the time. Ooh, oh god, shit, that heck. I'm not gonna lie, I jumped. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> that was not cool, man. It's like it played on my my security of finding a chow. Like, oh, chows are so sweet, they're amazing. It immediately puts you in a good spot, and then ghost. Uh, but yeah, no, the Knuckles music is amazing. It's incredible. All the music is amazing and incredible. But love, uh, love his take. Man, I'm psyched about Sonic 2, the movie. Like, I'm really psyched. Uh, the first movie was. Totally fine. I had no real problems with the first movie. I'm not going to sit here and say it was like an amazing movie, but I thought for what it was doing, the effort it made, um, it did a really good job. So the second one, if it can be a little bit better, that would be awesome. Idris Alba is fucking Knuckles. I love that. He sounds great in the trailer. Like, man, I'm psyched. I think, I think it's going to be good. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Which is crazy that we're like, we came, not only is it a video game movie, but it was a video game movie that initially launched with that horrendous design. Um, and wow, did they turn that around. Holy crap. Part of me almost feels like that design was like intentional, like just to get people talking about it and like, but nah, I, I can't imagine, right? That would have been a lot of wasted money. So yeah, I'm psyched. I want to see it. Might even like do something special around the time it comes out. I wonder if there's a point to getting two Chow Keys. Like, as far as I can tell... Oh, give me, come here, little birdie. As far as I can tell, the Chow Keys just, um... get you into the Chow Garden, right? Um... I don't know. Mr. Penguin Man! Join us! Oh, that's creepy. Whoa! Death everywhere! Alright, let's see here. Got more ghosts! Get out of here. Scary. Alright, I just saw it. Just saw it. Let's see here. Can I... Oh man, I bet I gotta go like up and around or something. You know, do something like that. Let me see here. Like I gotta raise the water level probably. Or I'm overthinking this way too much like a knucklehead. Who knows. Let's see here. Uh, where was that three level again? Here's two. Was three at the top? No, I think it was like tucked away, right? Let me see. Move it, Knuckles! Alright. Two? Maybe that's enough? Maybe? Nah, I probably need three, right? It looked like a... Like a three thing. That's just a little bit of water. 
Yeah, it was tucked away. Was it this way or this? Is this where I just came from? Oh yeah, yeah. So I need to raise a little bit more. Yep, that's the thing. All right, cool. Where are you three? Where'd you go? Was it in here? Yeah, I think it was actually. Might have been in here. No, no, it wasn't. I just, dang it, I just lost it. I think it was for ah. There we go. There's three. But where? Oh, seal. Love you, seal. Um, why are you gonna taunt me with this? Like, or is it one? Like, is one the highest? Because since three is low, is it? Dude, I don't know. I suck at knuckles. Super knuckles. Super knucklehead. <laughs> Let's try one. See what happens. That sounds promising. Yep. Cool. I think this is going to do the trick. Let's see what happens. Alright. Where were you? It was like, yeah, that mine shaft. Okay. It'd be cool if you could like swim like a little bit faster, Knuckles. But whatever. You can go down quick. All right, come on. Yeah, there we go, Durden. You're kind of smart sometimes. Every now and then. Let's go. Don't drown, Knuckles. Come on out. Yeah, good stuff. All right, cool. Knock that one out relatively quickly. Five and a half minutes. Not too shabby. Go! What we got? D for Durden? Ah, C. That's not as good as a D. <laughs> If I'm going to get a shitty crate, I would at least want it to match my name. That would be nice. All right. And we get to go to Chow World, too. Let's check up and see. We can finally confirm the theory of I've been working with on, you know, if we're hatching these damn things correctly. You know, Knuckles, you should probably take these off before handling, like, infants. But, okay. A little, the metal things. All right. More animals. Cool. We're loaded. There's an egg. I set the other egg down, like, right here, right? Mm, doesn't look too promising. Let's see. Yeah. No, I don't think anything happened. So maybe I have to hatch this thing, like, while I'm in here. We gotta get a chow going. Let's check out what this is again, too. I don't remember. Chow departure machine. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. That's how you, like, tell your chow you don't love them anymore. Uh, so, let's see. Where did the egg go? What? Okay, <laughs> I thought it just disappeared. I'm gonna try just, like, rocking this for a while. So, uh, I hope you guys are ready for some riveting content. Because, oh, hey! <laughs> I didn't know you could pick up the animals. Where's my gorillas? Oh, man, did they not carry over? Sad. I wanted him to learn Phil Collins and sing You'll Be In My Heart. Raise him like a, a pack of gorillas. All right. So, uh, yeah, how was you guys' day? <laughs> uh, just just absolutely edgy or seat action right here. Knuckles, your face, bro? You might want to... Your face? Hmm. I'll do this for, like, a minute or two. But if nothing comes from this, then we're just going to have to move on. I feel like this feels familiar, though. I'm sorry I don't know exactly how to do this, guys. If we could get, like, some confirmed answers in the comments or something on, like, how to actually ha hatch a goddamn chow, that'd be great. This kind of works out, though, because what I'm actually considering doing, considering chows are basically an entirely different game, um, I think what I'd like to do is once we really get chows going, I'd like to stream that. Like, just stream the whole raising of the chow and, you know, and the building of the chow and the chow-like activities that we'll have, races and all that stuff. Um, I think that would fit better in a streaming format than that would in a recording format, but... What the hell do I know? Nothing. That's what, because I can't even hatch this goddamn egg! Put! Put! <laughs> Man, alright, yeah, I don't want to waste too much time in here. I, uh... Can I even do a chow race? Let's see. God, you're creepy as shit, man. <laughs> I would go to no event with you. So this eventually, you raise your chow, and then you can make them race. Um, but I don't, like, can I even do that since I don't have a chow? Nah, there we go. 
It's kind of dumb they even let me in here then. Old tease. Screwed up. Alright. Let's bail. Sorry, guys. We'll get to Chow's eventually. But when we get to Chow's, we are definitely getting to fucking Chow's. That is for sure. <laughs> what we got here? Capital City. Amy, still just keep it up. Always seems to be a lot of police around when you don't need them. True that, yeah, Sonic. <laughs> that is so true. For some reason, I'm not getting a signal from the six remaining Chaos Emeralds. Maybe Eggman took the emeralds into outer space. That's okay. Yeah, I guess that's actually kind of a reasonable conclusion, Tails. Check out that walkie-talkie he's using. What is that jank-ass shit? <laughs> hey, guys. Well, hey guys, what's up, man? I just like to, you know, swimming in shit in my spare time. Looking for the Master Emerald pieces was tougher than I thought it would be. Where are we, anyway? Everything seems tougher than you thought it would be, Knuckles. What the hell was that? That whole interaction was weird. What? You're doing all that through, like, a device that looks older than a Blackberry? Okay. Like, well okay. older than a... Like a walkie-talkie. You did all that with a walkie-talkie. Maybe you really are a genius, Tails. Hey, Ditch I Amy know. again. Ditch her in a strange city. Alright, so it looks like we have entered the Tails and Knuckles section of the game. This is the second Tails one in a row. There we go. Cool. Awesome! So this is like a race? Man, I wasn't holding X at the beginning. I hope I have enough time to make it to the end. Room, room, everybody! Super Sonic Racing! Gotta keep your feet right on the ground! Hard to sing that with this other song. Sonic R, best Sonic soundtrack, by the way. You know, just just so you know. Best Sonic soundtrack, no doubt. Oh shit! Oh shit! I mean, the Adventure series, uh, let's be real, like, all Sonic music is pretty godlike. Even from, like, the shitty games, it's pretty godlike. So so Sonic R is not a very good game. It's a fun game. Uh, but not the best one. It was actually the first Sonic game I ever owned, because I did not have a Genesis. Uh, so... Ah, oh, shit, I need to be boosting more. Checkpoints! <laughs> Alright. Uh, but yeah, Sonic R was the first Sonic game I owned, because I did not have a Genesis, and I went into, like, a TJ Maxx or something with my mom, and I saw Sonic R for PC. I was like, holy shit! I can finally play a Sonic game! Oh my god! And then I realized it was, like, not a typical Sonic game at all. But I still had a lot of fun with it, and then soundtrack fucking bangs. <laughs> Alright, cool. I think we're making fairly good time here, right? Like... Man, you be skidding those tires, Bales. Sounds like they might be kind of bald. I wanna get yourself over to a Bridgestone. Woo! I wonder what... What, like, determines the... <laughs> God, head-on collision. Uh, that's pretty rough. I wonder what determines the boost. It just seems like it comes back randomly almost. What did that say? Born to be fast? Hell yeah, I am. All right. Checkpoint. Gotta say, this is an extremely open highway for a city. Like, what do I have to do to get Atlanta traffic like this? That would be really nice. One car. One car. <laughs> and quite a large... Born to be fast. True that. Hashtag born to be fast. Oh my god. Born to be fast. Born. Okay. Alright. Well, we get it now. <laughs> A taxi. Ram it. Oh, I don't want to ram it. I don't want to screw this up because, yeah, this is, I guess, okay, but there's not a whole lot going on here. I'm just going straight. I kind of vaguely remember this level, but... Obviously not one of my favorites. I think Eggman's funner to play, uh, more fun to play than uh, than Tails too, because he's goddamn Eggman, and I really like Eggman. He's awesome. I'm a villains guy. I like, you know, I, I like villains. In, mo in most media, if you give me a really good villain and a really good um, hero, I'm usually gonna side for the villain. All right. Wow, this is a uh, this is a straight road. <laughs> oh, that's the limo. Okay, cool. All right, now just line it up. What are you gonna do with the president? Just, just shoot the limo. What are you What are you trying to do with the president? I don't remember. What are we trying to do? Are we trying to kill the president? Kill the president of the United States? Rank C. All right. I mean, I still wish I got my D's, but whatever.
not a whole lot to talk about with that level. <laughs> um, great. Awesome. I can do that kind of boring segment anytime I want. Fantastic. Show that since the incident three hours ago, the country is in turmoil. Turmoil our country. Communities are impacted and our satellite communications are down. Well, you know, he destroyed he the fucking moon. So this once again, guys. This is a national crisis. Yeah, duh. It's way more than a national crisis. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's a galactic crisis. Um, just what is it that you want, dude? Doctor Regnet. <laughs> oh, well, okay. Let's just get down to business then, shall we, Mr. President? Eggman's voice actor is so good. Always has been good. I, you are a very I feel like he's deeper in this game though than I remember. My demands are quite simple: surrender to the Eggman Empire and make no attempts to resist. <laughs> Otherwise. 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 <laughs> that president. Holy shit. Is that the most, like, vanilla ass president I could ever see? Oh. <laughs> it's a Bill Clinton president. That <laughs> Those eyes look like something was going on below the waist there for a minute. I'm a hedgehog. I jumped in. Secret Service would have shot me instantly. <laughs> so the, the president of the United States just drives down the street with the sunroof open? Okay. What is writing? Steal the President of the United States data! <laughs> Holy shit! Mr. President, we're receiving an incoming signal from our agent. This is the most ill protected president of all time. Uh, Seven Wonders? Can we destroy that? You guys got here pretty quick. Okay. And more importantly, I saw that Batgirl go inside with him as well. Why is that more important? You saw them too, right? Well, yeah. Kind of seem focused on the Batgirl. Knuckles. From there, I don't know what this space colony is all about, but I'll find and destroy that cannon and then kick their Imperial butts. All right. All, all right. I'll go and find the entrance. All right, Tails. You do that. Cool. Okay, uh, dang, I need to time how long I've been recording these things. I think this is probably a good place to stop. I feel like if this is a long level, which Tails levels are sometimes, um, then yeah, it could go on a while. So I'll stop it here. I'll maybe see what this motherfucker has to say. Okay, yes, alright. Decent tip there. We can leave you off thinking that this guy's a good guy today. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will be back, uh, soon. And uh, most likely, yeah, I'll be back. I'll be back. I'll be back. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna play the game. How about that? <laughs> I'll be back very soon. Uh, I'm gonna get this skunk as well. I'm gonna take him with me while I leave. So, uh, peace out, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. <laughs> Tails won't though, cause he's dead.